Hi, I'm Freya Ravensbergen, and I played Laura Porter in A Brand New You. I saw a lot of myself in her, um, or perhaps I saw kind of my fear of what I... I could see myself potentially turning into Laura if I were to go in a direction that I didn't want to go in. So it was interesting for me to kind of go to a place with her that I could easily see myself going, but it's kind of my worst nightmare to actually go there. Um, but it all turns out nice in the end as well, so it's kind of like a, a nice way to kind of see her get over that and, you know, go through her self-discovery as well. I think the hardest part was being prepared for one scene and then finding out half an hour later that I wasn't shooting that scene and in fact I was crying in the bathroom instead and that I hadn't learned the lines for that and it was just like, okay, I have 20 minutes to be really focused and to learn these lines and to just be as present as I can before that moment. So that was challenging, but it was also exciting because it just makes you more malleable and you really feel like a real actor because you don't have an hour to sit in your trailer and worry about how you're going to say one line. You're just there, so you don't really have a choice but to be in the moment. My least favorite scene was vomiting outside Mine over too. and over and over again. <laughs> that was my least favorite. My favorite scene, I think the one that came together in the most memorable way is the one with Vanessa in the bathroom um, and that was one of those scenes that I was not prepared for. I did not prepare for that scene at all that day and then when we were told we were going to do it I panicked a little bit and uh, that ended up being one of the ones that I remember feeling really present for. I think all the good stories get told on low budgets. I mean I think that you know they're all the, the stories where there's characters that people can really relate to. You know the big movies you know, I don't see myself in Prometheus, I don't see myself in uh, Day After Tomorrow or any of those big action films. I, I see myself in those smaller, smaller movies, the ones that are kind of, you know, barely got made and those are the ones that really touch me. My, my goal with the film is I'd love to see it in TIFF. Uh, I'd love to see it on a big screen with lots of people that I don't know and I'd love for it to sell. That would be amazing. Just to make our money back, that would be amazing. Um, and also the more important thing is that it, you know, turns into something that people might recognize, something that I'm proud to show to people so that we can have some more credit for the next film. Raise the bar. I feel like if everybody just gave that small amount that they could give, even if they feel like that's not even really enough, and they're not giving it all, it takes five minutes, it's a small amount of money that you forget about, and that really makes the difference for us, it makes or breaks the movie.